Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to make this cool scroll effect in WordPress using Motion Page. I will be using Elementor Page Builder, but this will work with Bricks Builder, Oxygen Builder or any other page builder as well. I will also make it responsive for mobile devices. You can use this for your products, services or even for portfolios, as every image can be clickable with desired link. I got the inspiration from this website called United Sodas of America, and they are using code for this effect, but we will not be using any code at all. So, let's get started. Let's start by adding a new page. Give it a name. I am setting the template to Elementor Canvas to start with a blank page. Publish the page and then click on Edit with Elementor. Add a new container and set the content width to full width. Now add another container inside the parent container and make it full width as well. Add the heading widget inside the container and style it accordingly. Let's add another container below the heading container. Add an image in the second container. Select the desired image you want to show. Set the container direction to row horizontal. Duplicate the image five more times and select the desired images. Also give an ID for all the images, make sure the ID is same for all images, and set the width to inline auto. Rename the image's container, then go to Advance and set the position to Absolute. I will add a dummy section under the main section so we can scroll the page to see the animation.
Let's update the page. Now let's open the motion page. Create a new timeline and give it a name. Select the page from the drop-down. Select the trigger to scroll trigger, and click unlock to scroll bar. Also give an ID to the main section. and add that ID to the pin element selector. Set the start and end values to zero. Now copy the image ID and paste it into animation selector and hit enter. Increase the start value to 20% so we can have some space at the top. and set the translate value to 165 VW. This value will depend on the size of the images, so give this value according to your design. Let's save the timeline and check the page from the front end. Now in order to add a tilt animation click on 3D transform and set a value for Z axis. As the images are 2D and we cannot add 3D images in Elementor so we cannot rotate the images in Y direction. That's why I only gave the value for Z axis. Let's add a different section for mobile devices. Rename the container and hide this container for desktop and tablet devices. Also hide the first section for mobile only. Copy the first heading container and paste it in the mobile container and style it accordingly. Now add a new container for images and set its direction to column vertical Add the first image, select the image.
and go to Advance. Click on Transform and rotate it to 270 degree. Then go to Style and set the width according to image size. Add negative top and bottom margins to remove the extra spacing around the image. Now give the image a different ID and duplicate the images. Also set the width to inline auto for all images. Let's update the page. Now open the motion page again from dashboard and create a new timeline and give it a name. Select the page from the drop-down. And set the trigger to scroll trigger and click on lock to scroll bar. Also click on the pinned element. Add a unique ID for the mobile section as well and update the page. Go back to motion page and paste that ID in the pin selector. Change the start and end value to zero. Then copy the mobile images ID and paste it into the animation selector and hit enter. Go back to the page and set the position of images container to absolute and update the page. Go back to motion page and click on refresh and click on translate and give Y value in rem. So set this value according to the image sizes you will use. I am setting it from 18 rem to minus 47 rem. And then save the timeline. Now go to the front end of the page and check the mobile view.
So that's it. This is how you can make this cool scroll animation in WordPress using Motion Page. This can be done with any page builder. If this video helps you in any way then please like this video and subscribe to my channel as I will be making more videos like this. Thanks for watching.